Hello guys, this is Mauro from GreenFotech.com and on this video we're going to look at the new features and changes included on Windows 10 build 18.272. This is a new test preview for Windows 10 version 19.03 expected to release sometime in 2019. Now let's have a closer look at the most important changes in this release. In the start menu you won't find big changes but you can now right click on a group name or tile folder and you will now see an option to unpin it from the start menu. Starting with build 18.272, the colors page has been updated. So now the options to switch to the dark and light theme and transparency effect are now located to the top instead of the bottom of the page. Also starting with this flight, Windows 10 is visually updating and rewarding the descriptions on the uh, signing options page to make it easier for users to set up Windows Hello authentication methods. Also starting with this flight, the standard users will now have the option to forget a wireless network connection. Previously, it was only an option available for administrators. Other minor changes on Windows 10 built 18.272 includes the support to use the uh, control and mouse wheel to zoom text on command prompt, PowerShell, and when using the uh, Windows subsystem for Linux. Also, when switching color modes on Windows 10, We'll now also update the scroll bar for Command Prompt, PowerShell, and the Windows subsystem for Linux. With build 18.272, the uh, Swift key feature on Windows 10 is also expanding to more languages. Microsoft is adding the index phonetic keyboards to more languages as well. And there are new narrator improvements. Like narrator will now alert you when you accidentally type in with the caps lock turn on and more. You can learn more about these improvements by using the link in the video description below. And that's pretty much all that's new with Windows 10 built 18.272. Remember to like the video, leave your comments, subscribe to the channel if you haven't done that yet. And I just hope this video was informative for you and I would like to thank you for viewing.